Vanessa. I'm Jens. And we are late to the party, and one of the childhood terrors that we all carried with us growing up was the scary stories to tell in the dark series. Yeah, I remember checking it out of the school library every chance that I could to watch, to read these stories. Like, even though some of them did scare me, they were still fascinating. I'm just like, this is kind of a fascinating story in my head, so... I'm really looking forward to seeing how Guillermo del Toro will take those stories and create it and make it his own. Yeah, I've never actually read these books, but right. what sold me on this is Guillermo del Toro tackling right. like something else in horror. He's one of my favorite filmmakers working today. I think the dude's immensely talented. Sure. And especially like the horror field, like he re really good creature features, really good with like scary stuff. So. Can't wait to see what he's got to pull out here. So let's take a look. I know there's three 15 second uh, TV spots that they did, so we're gonna watch them all back to back right now. From Guillermo del Toro. Okay. Oh no, it's the big toe! The what? Oh. Scary stories. I hate this one. Rated. From Guillermo That's del Toro. Scary. We're next. We're next. Scary stories. This film is not yet rated. Based on the iconic book series. Oh, not Game of Toro? What is What is that? What? Scary stories. This film is not yet rated. Based oh, on there the was more. Oh, okay. Series. More than three. Oh, yeah, this one. What the hell? <laughs> scary stories. This film is. Because that could happen in real life. Okay. Uh, no. That that screech too when she was about to touch it and it moves like nails on a chalkboard type. <laughs> so scary stories to tell in the dark. One of the biggest things that I can recall about the series, um, the artwork. Yes. The yep. artwork that went into each story, and it was usually some of them were very short stories, but they would have like this artwork that I've just never seen before. It was frightening compared to those stories themselves. It was a fantastic supplement to the stories and that were in these They books. were very unique too, like the, the graphics and the illustrations that they used for these stories were very unique. Like the, gra the illustrations themselves were sometimes scarier than the actual story that they were associated with. So uh, I'm excited to see which ones he does in this movie and I hope that, um, I'm not sure if he's gonna like combine all the books into this one movie or if they're gonna see how well this does from the first book and then maybe go on to more scary stories to tell in the dark and then right. if that does really well maybe do scary stories three right. so I don't know we'll see or maybe get like a scary story cinematic universe yeah, it's basically. possible and that's the thing I'm wondering is if it is gonna end up being more of a narrative with the elements of scary stories uh, or like goosebumps or is it gonna end up being anthology style where it's this story this story this story but it's I happening think that would around do well too. I, I imagine it might gonna be the second part I think it's gonna be anthology which isn't a bad thing I mean I, right. I, I love creep show I love the Twilight Zone movie course, yes. so yeah this is very unlike of that and it looks really good so it does it's crazy it. creepy and they didn't need to give us a whole lot and the fact they have the toe isn't that the one where like in the soup Yep. Yeah, okay. <laughs> what? What? Oh, yeah. yeah. We'll, we'll get the yeah. books for it. I had the books, too. I don't know where they are. But either way, thank you guys for watching our reaction to the spots for Scary Stories to Tell in the Dark. It's funny. CBS Films called us out because uh, I found out that these were dropping. I posted about it on our Twitter. And uh, CBS Films came out like, like oh, hey, you, you forgot something? about some. Because I was like, oh, there's two. And they're like, oh, excuse me. You forgot about <laughs> some. There's not, there's not. Just watch. It's like, okay, well, I can't. If, if you're going to break news doing right, right. Yeah. <laughs> which uh yeah i said scary stories was coming out i didn't exactly say that there would be three or four but either way i'm excited that we even got one so thank you guys you can like and subscribe and do the thing on our facebook twitter tumblr instagram stardust all the social networking gin joints you know who they are kick 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 in the party fill the party keep the party going on our patreon gets us where we need to go sorry i just it's been a long day chance thanks for joining us of course of course where can they find you uh twitter instagram chance wars underscore 91 you can check me out at my personal youtube channel chance the critic and check out my podcast pwca notorious by chance and uh serious study which will be dropping soon hey, anyways now it's time to say goodbye <laughs> bye bye, bye. <laughs>